Innovation to me means the novel transformation of an existing process, practice, artifact, or institution. And importantly, innovation doesn't necessarily entail progress. My biggest success, I think, has been contributing to a world where increasingly the words ethics and values belong and are understood as belonging in any conversation about technology or innovation. In my first university course in philosophy, I actually received a pretty mediocre mark, which was a terrible shock to me. And it took me a while to figure out uh, whether I had really hit an intellectual limit or whether I was just lazy. Unfortunately, I eventually discovered it was the latter, but it did teach me a great lesson, which is to never accept a limit until I've tested it. My friends would say that my greatest strength is self-control and my greatest weakness is my reluctance to surrender it. As a child, I learned to cope with chaos by trying to plan for every contingency and every disaster, but sometimes you just have to breathe and let life happen. It depends on what kind of reader you are. I might recommend, depending upon what I know about you, The Fall by Albert Camus, or uh, The Dispossessed by Ursula Le Guin, or The Parable of the Sower by Octavia Butler, or The Children of Time by Adrian Tchaikovsky, or Piranesi by Susan, Susanna Clarke. Our collective inertia and group denial in the face of planetary ruin. Sleeping, no question. My mother told me that loss is the price that you pay for loving and that fear is the price that you pay for trying and both are worth it. I'd like to see an innovation in what we collectively value. Even if we were able to invent abundant, clean energy or travel to the stars, it wouldn't make a difference unless we were able to make a change in what we care about. Think of human history and how many times we've lost our way collectively and individually, and how many times we've found a path again and found a path to something better. And I think there's always a path if we're willing to look for it together.